Hello, my name is Paul Ferber. I'm the founder of Marine Conservation Cambodia, and what you just saw is the reason for my involvement. We are a small, self-sustaining local NGO which over the past 10 years has been protecting Cambodia's ocean from destructive and illegal fishing. We are now based on Kose, a small island in the Kep Archipelago dedicated to conservation. After helping establish the first marine fisheries management areas around the islands of Koh Rong, Koh Rong Samlom, we were invited to KEP by the Cambodian government to carry on our conservation work. We've been creating the scientific baselines in KEP Archipelago for all of the marine areas with our Khmer staff and international volunteers and scientists. We also have a long-lasting collaboration with the local small-scale fishing communities which provide us with an awareness of what are the most pressing local issues for them and for the marine environment. As you may realize, Kev Archipelago is under intense ecological pressure because of such destructive fishing as electric trawling, pear trawling, and seine nets. Because of Kep's particularly threatened ecosystem, it was an emergency, and we had to think of a rapid and effective solution. After exchanging knowledge between all the stakeholders, such as the fisheries administration and the local fishing communities, we began the implementation of a new marine fisheries management area around the Kep Archipelago. This is Cambodia's second ever marine fishery management area. As well as protecting the resources, our aim is to give small scale fishers in Kep province and other communities elsewhere new tools so that they can look after the oceans themselves. At the same time, it will create good, solid local stakeholders with a keen interest in protecting and restoring the marine environment. This creates an overriding reason for them to protect their own ocean. To improve the marine protected area efficiency, we have designed a unique, robust and cost-effective artificial reef which snags and entangles bottom trawling nets, reducing the illegal and destructive bottom trawl fishery within the archipelago. Thanks to the modular design, the units can be built to different heights, lengths for various depths, thus avoiding impacts on regular legal navigation and legal fishing gears. This structure also acts as an artificial marine reef, creating complex and diverse habitats to refer, restore the ecosystem. But to make this difference, we will need your help. MCC will have to construct 54 artificial reefs for this project. Each structure will include 21 concrete blocks. In total, we will need to build and deploy over a thousand blocks, which is a lot of effort and a lot of resources for us. Through this crowdfunding, you won't just help us to get the concrete and the sand, you will help us build the reefs and you will help us deploy them. And you will make this marine fishery management area happen. This support will allow us to keep our independency and spread the word. As our volunteers coming to help us from all over the world, you can participate and help Cambodia's ocean. But we should never forget that the greatest threat to our planet is the belief that somebody else will save it. It's <laughs> up, Three. 